Hello all, welcome to this instruction video about doing a cash withdrawal at the Western Union against the blue dollar rate. By using the blue dollar rate, you will receive a better exchange rate in Argentina, which gives you approximately the double amount of pesos. In this video, we will show you three easy steps that you can easily do this cash withdrawal against the blue dollar rate. Step 1. Create an account at Western Union. Step 2. Transfer money to your account. Step 3. Pick up cash at Western Union agent. First, creating your account. Go to the website westernunion.com to create your account or use the application on your mobile phone. Make sure to enter your contact details as well. This will smoothen the process later on, as you will always need your contact details to do a payment. If you don't do this correctly, you will be prompted later, so no worries there. You will be asked to verify your identity. If you do not do this, there will be a limit to the total amount of transactions you can do via Western Union. This is approximately $1,000 or euros. If you choose to use the IDIN, you will be redirected to your online bank account. This takes only a couple of minutes. The verification by letter takes approximately two weeks, dependent on your area of residence. Second, transferring money to your account. First of all, open the application on your mobile phone or go to your browser and open your Western Union account. Start by clicking Send Money. This will open a screen where your transaction starts. Start by selecting Argentina in the Send To field. After that, you can indicate how much money you would like to transfer and therewith withdraw. For the case of the example, we take only one euro. Next, you can select Cash Pickup, after which you can see some payment methods. There are four payment methods. The fastest options are credit or debit card, instant bank transfer, or paying in cash. With those options, you can collect your money within 10 minutes at Western Union. The option bank transfer takes one to two business days. Now select your payment method and you will see the conversion rate when you've done so. Click next to move on. Here you should accept the conditions if you do so of course to move on with this money transfer. This brings you to the receiver part. If you want to collect the money yourself, you should enter your own details here. Make sure that the information is in line with your identification document, for example your passport. Now click add a new receiver. In this page, you can enter all your or the, or the receiver's full name and optionally other information. When you have done this exercise once, the receiver's information can be selected from the shortlist, like John Doe in the example. At the bottom of the screen, you need to make sure to select at purpose of transport the option travel expenses. Next, at Source of Funds, you should select Savings. Then click Next to move on. This brings you to the payment. Here, you can proceed with the payment as per the selected payment method and enter all the necessary details as usual. 
After having performed the payment, you will receive an overview of the transaction, which you can review. At the bottom of the screen, you should indicate whether you will perform transactions occasionally or regularly. This ties back to the identification requirement for more frequent transfers. Finally, agree to the terms and conditions and click send to complete this transaction. Now a screen pops up with an empty CN code. This code can be used at the Western Union agent to pick up the cash. Also, you can use this code to track your payment. It starts with in progress and once it becomes available, you can logically pick it up at the Western Union. This should not take more than 10 minutes. Except, of course, for the payment option bank transfer. The first step, picking up cash at the Western Union agent. In the application, you can find most nearby Western Union agents that serve you. Also, on Google Maps or on the internet, you can easily search for Western Union agents. And to be sure, there are many, many Western Union locations in Argentina. But keep in mind the following. Bring your identification document and your MTCN code to the Western Union to identify yourself for the cash withdrawal. We recommend to go early during the day as they sometimes run out of cash, which is quite unfortunate. Waiting time can be long also on more popular locations or when less Western Union agents are available in the area. So be sure to have some time. Good luck with your first transaction at the Western Union with those three steps. Thanks for listening. Did you like this explanation? Please like us then. Do you have any recommendations or questions? Please leave a review or a comment and we will look at it.